the main purpose of this video and the main reason for making it is to just show you how I um, steam the milk with this machine. Um, when I when I first bought this machine, I did struggle a little bit to get kind of silky milk, um, you know, kind of stuff that you see making amazing latte. I, I figured out a bit of a way uh, to kind of get the most out of it, hopefully, in terms of those of us that are looking to make flat whites. First thing I always do is just flush the system um, and also warm the cup at the same time. So obviously making sure that there's water in the tank back here. So we put that aside. I'll just put it here so it's out of the way. So I've filled up my milk jug um, up to the 120 mark or maybe just above it. Again, at the base of the spout. So tamp done, uh, milk ready, cup pre-warming, machine's ready to go. So I put a filter uh, twisted into the machine, all ready to go. Cups good and pre-warmed and nice and hot. Um, you'll see that I pull the cup quite far forward onto the edge of the machine, just because I want my coffee to basically hit the side wall of the cup. So it kind of cradles it down into the bottom of the cup. Um, and I'm not getting kind of, if it's in the middle there, you kind of get those two hole marks um, where the coffee has gone down into. So I like to just pull it forward if I've got the space to play with it. Single basket shot, so hit that. Pre-infusion, just pull it forward a little bit more. There you go. Okay, that's our shot. As soon as the shot's been pulled, I'm going up here and hitting the steam button to get it warmed up. Um, steaming temperature's higher than espresso temperature so um, it takes a few seconds for the boiler to warm up and also what I've done I've, gr I've gr just grabbed a cup or a glass rather um, but you can use a cup just to put under the spout of the steaming one okay so now the steam is ready the thing to understand with this steaming one on the Dedica 685 um, and bear in mind it's different to the 680 so if it's, this only applies if you've got the 685 there are two modes on here for the steaming wand one is cappuccino, the other is hot milk. The milk for a cappuccino is different to the milk that we want for a flat white. Obviously, there is no flat white option here. And so this workaround in terms of getting that silky milk basically uses both. Because what I found um, is that if you just leave it in the cappuccino mode, you just get this massive jug of really f frothy, uh, foamy uh, milk that doesn't really do anything in, uh, for, a, for a flat white. And you definitely can't get any latte art out of it, which is, which is fine if you want a cappuccino, but not so fine if you want a flat white or want to try and do some latte art. But we're going we're gonna to use the cappuccino mode first. We're going to try and we're going to get we're going to introduce some bubbles um, and some steam. But then before it becomes, you know, turns into foam, we're going to flick it up. Um, while it's in the milk, um, kind of midway through the steaming process, so that um, there's no more bubbles being introduced into the milk, and it's just then swirling the milk and heating it up, as well as incorporating and uh, integrating those bubbles that we've already put in there. Um, and so I'll, I'll just show you how I do that. We're just going to flush flush the steaming one, get rid of any water. We're in cappuccino mode. I'm going to turn the steaming one on. We're going to be just below the surface of the milk. Just wait for it. Putting back slightly, just slide it down as it kind of rises. And then at this point, I'm just going to switch it up hot midway through to the hot milk position and just let it swirl. And then now it shouldn't be introducing any more bubbles. I think that's done. Turn it off. Take it off, give it a wipe, get on swirling this milk, give it a couple of big knocks, keep swirling, and then we're going to incorporate. You're looking for that kind of melted ice cream slash white emulsion paint kind of texture. Okay, and then bring the coffee over, and then you just want to... There you go. So there you have it. That's the DeLonghi Dedica 685M um, using the standard steam wand uh, that comes with it to try and get something to replicate a flat white or a latte that you'd be ordering in a coffee shop. Trick is to
basically use the cappuccino mode on the steaming wand um, until the milk kind of starts uh, incorporating the bubbles and as soon as it starts doing that flick it up to the hot milk position and what you're looking for is that melted ice cream slash white paint emulsion uh, kind of texture um, and then you can just keep practicing with the latte art um, to kind of try and get something in there that looks decent but that's that's relatively silky um, got a bit of foam on top yeah give it a go see what you get um, it does take a bit of playing with it um, but once you've got it actually you'll be making really cool um, flat white type drinks or latte style drinks uh, and hopefully that helps someone try to replicate that flat white type milk texture um, at home especially while you're in lockdown Thanks for watching um, and we'll see you soon.